Amanda Berry, who became famous for playing Alma Sedgwick on Coronation Street, said she did not feel she could come out as gay during her time on the show. The star revealed she felt she wasn't allowed to be her authentic self for two decades in a candid interview on Loose Women. Amanda, 86, starred in Coronation Street from 1981 to 1982, and again from 1988 to 2001. Throughout that time, the actress refused to confirm her sexuality in public and did not reveal her lesbian identity until after her time on the soap had came to an end. Amanda appeared on Loose Women Today with her wife Hilary Bonner and was asked by the panel what it was like having to keep her sexuality hidden for so long. There was no camo of any kind at that time, Amanda explained. There were various people in charge of the show, so they called the tune. Do we call it homophobic? Call it what you like. The actress then went on to claim that some of her colleagues would have refused to work with her if she had come out as gay. What people did was they sold you to the press who thought, there's a story there, she began. The press came and the very same people who would have done that would then say, I'm not going to work with someone who's gay. The actress went on to confirm that her co-stars were actually well aware of her sexuality long before she came out to the public. Everyone knew I was gay, she exclaimed, before admitting that she had only divulged her secret to a few chosen confidants. Amanda said, nobody at Coronation Street knew but my very close friends Helen, Worth, Sue Nichols and Barbara Knox. The star was with her partner Hillary for 10 years before they finally tied the knot at London's Drury Lane Theatre in 2014. Amanda has previously insisted that Coronation Street bosses would have let her go if she had come out in the 1980s. In an episode of the Conversation Street podcast, she recalled, I spent a fortune on solicitors because believe me if that had happened to me at that time they would not have kept me in Coronation Street and I will stand by that. Not because of them, the producers, but because of people, who shall be nameless, who would have said, I'm not working with her. Express.co.uk has contacted a representative for ITV for comment. Amanda had some memorable storylines during her time on the show, including a problematic marriage to the long-running character Mike Baldwin, Johnny Briggs, alongside a kidnapping, and a supermarket siege. When she decided to finally leave the ITV soap in 2001, her character was killed off in a highly controversial cervical cancer storyline. Apart from her soap fame, Amanda has enjoyed a varied stage and TV career, even starring in two of the Carry On films. In 2003, the star also played the role of Bev Tull in ITV's prison drama Bad Girls. Loose Women returns tomorrow at 12.30pm on ITV.